Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Delhi Tarot and these are your weekly reading, the quick reading, the short reading for the sun, moon and the rising sign of Sagittarius. This is a weekly reading for the month of August, the current going on month. I will be doing the reading for the first week itself because the energy do continue to the second week and I would like to see the inside. This is going to be a general group reading, so please pick it up what resonates with you. Please leave the rest for others. And you know very well that in case you want to connect with me for a personal private reading or a healing process, my email ID, my website is mentioned in the description box below for you to reach out to me for any service you may need from Delhi Tarot. You want to learn, you want to learn tarot, you want to learn healing courses, you want to get your reading done, you want to get your healing done. Every service is a prepaid, pre-purchased, pre-booked process. Mm -hmm. Please connect with me with that understanding. I really appreciate that. And as always, if you really like what I do on the channel, please do like, subscribe the channel and put on the notifications. I'm going to pull out one card for each week. And I'm also going to pull out the overall card of the month. And so far you have the number 99. And I do see that this month is going to be the month of little struggle uh, in the time to come. You overall energy is three of pentacles. Socializing, networking for your growth, for your better money, for better uh, possibilities, for better opportunities is needed by you the most during this month week one you have page of Raphael week two you have the new beginning coming in week three you have ten of Michael end of a very difficult situation which is coming here also and then you have four of Michael so you do have very strong presence of Archangel Michael who is giving you the protection against the odd and simultaneously the healing is also going on. Now before I move on, I would definitely like to see the message related to angel number 99 because it came so prominently into your reading. It says the spiritual world has an urgent message for you. Get to work on your divine life purpose now. Ask the spirit world to help you with motivation, clarity, direction and anything else you need right at the moment. Now this is a message which says that you need support this month. So be vocal about it. You know, talk to your friends, talk to your well-wishers, whatever support you need. You need to be very, very clear. You need to explicitly talk about it. You, you need to actually ask for it. And there are people for your support. So this is actually a part of self-care and self-love. When you know that you need something and you call out for help, there are people around you. In week one, you have page of Raphael which says a new emotional situation, messages regarding relationship or social invitation, great intuitive insight. Now this is a this is a situation wherein it says that something emotionally is hurting you, is bothering you. Sagittarius, you need to work around that and you need to let it go. Because this is the energy which is which is you know acquiring some space in you in order to feel rested, rejuvenated and charged up again for whatever you want to do in life, you need to let go something very important which has given you crisis. And this can only come from your own self-introspection. It also says, because your overall energy is three of pentacles and that is why I told you the more and more you meet people uh, professionally and even when you expand your personal circle, you will see that the overall holistic growth is happening and you are coming out of your shell as well and seven of pentacle in week one says that if there is a major decision to be taken or you are waiting for some major thing to happen you need to wait this is absolutely an indication that something you are waiting desperately which you know Sagittarius is very big for you so running away you know uh, being very aggressive is not going to help you out showing up more patience is or you know more waiting period that is you needed right at the moment so wait and watch things will come to its fruition for sure in time to come 
in week two you have few new beginnings coming up into your life it says starting a new life altogether finding your purpose of forgiving and compassionate review of the past you know i didn't read this card when i was reading your card one but somehow the card was giving me the feeling that you need to let go some past incident and this is what is happening in new beginning the new beginning is actually at your doorstep sagittarius it is you who has to embrace now this is not just personal and professional what i am sensing from this card is new way of living life new way of thinking about life so something you need to go ahead and adopt as a style of living which is going to be a new living for you and you also are uh, going through you know anxiety and stress and you need to work it out what is it which is bothering you is it worth to worry about is it worth to take stress and you need to work out you know mere worrying is not going to help you out if you know that you are working hard towards it things are at uh, you know are uh, at its own pace and place with your hard work please know that you will get the fruit because you have a card of confirmation seven of pentacle which is sooner or later even if you have to wait the wait is 100% going to give you the results for sure you also have a card of 10 of michael which says a situation has ended so yes why the new beginning is about to happen because suddenly you will see that the tough time is getting over because there is a change in your outlook there is a change in your style of living it says a situation has ended and you are finally free from any kind of obligations mental emotional obligations it says new opportunity are at your doorstep for happiness fill follow now put the past behind oh my goodness so each and every card is telling you to deconnect with your past to disconnect all the cords and then move forward and it says that you are not trusting people yourself again obviously if something has not happened well with you in the past it is a normal human behavior but the only solution is forgive forget i understand it might be difficult in lot many cases with lot many people but then if you are not trusting the process the universe the the nature how the nature will give back to you so you need to work upon on yourself let go the past cut the cord work around your trust confidence build that up again and you need to show up again in relationship and your work whether it's personal whether it's professional it says that you're not trusting even yourself in many cases you're not trusting divine in many cases because of your past experience that need to let go week 4 you have four of michael inside that come from quiet meditation that is self introspection the need for more sleep or time off seek relief from stress that is also coming with nine of sword now this card you, you know if you see your reading sagittarius today your cards are repeating there are two prominent message into your reading one you need to let go the past second you are taking stress you need i mean this is this is a word of caution taking stress is not going to help you out you need to understand that your health is also more important seek relief from any anxiety any stress speak to your friends you need to call out for help that is the first message i gave you in the reading today you need to call out where you want help because people are there people are willing to 100% offer any type of help to you and five of sword in the end of the reading is you are getting you know it seems that because of the circumstances you're getting over possessive about something you know you're getting over protective about things so think about it it's good to be over protective but have a thin line you know try to be as neutral as possible and non judgmental and that will be into your favor for sure now let us see which angel therapy card do we have for you and which angel therapy is going to help you out and you have got two messages today the card of crystal says the energy of crystal support you and help you with the present situation so the more if you feel that yes i love using crystal you can and the situation the tough time the karmic circles which is going on it is absolutely related to your past life issues it says the situation has a basis in one of your uh, past life ask your angels to help you remember release learn and heal from your past experiences as soon as possible 
that's a very clear cut reading today now let us see your last messages of the reading i'm going to pull out star seed messages and it says vibration your vibration is being re raised to higher levels you are connected to cosmic intelligence and the next card of the reading is courage it says live your life fearlessly with courage strength and determination wonderful and that's your own fire energy or your own sign sagittarius and your last card of the reading is dreams the universe speaks to you through your dreams that does not mean you keep on sleeping all the time it means try to remember if you remember any sign and symbol from your dream that means some message is getting communicated to you it's your style your wish your free will how you want to decode the message you are receiving from your dreams these are signs and symbols try to connect the dots and there is your message just try that out it is a wonderful way of dream interpretation i will see you next time very soon be blessed